What is going on guys and welcome back to another grounded video. We just came off out of the red ant lab and we uh poisoned the red ant queen. It's the red ant lab, I'm in the red ant hill. And we poisoned the red ant queen. Sent her to her grave and we collected her parts and she gave us red ant queen pheromone. Red Ant Queen Chunk and Red Ant Queen Head. And we had all those scanned, which gave us some unique items, which is the um, Ant Queen Scepter, which is Summon HP. And there's the um, What else did we get? We got the Ant Queen. Yeah, red strategist mask. And then the uh fuck. It's just buried deep in here. Red strategist coat, and I guessing that just makes the makes the things that you summon better. I'm guessing it's just used for summoning ants. If I had to guess, that would make the most sense. But yeah. Um, so we killed the red ant queen. That was like my fuck. That was my like my objective of the recent objective that I've had for the past few episodes, and finally I got it done. So that's pretty cool. I'm thinking in this episode, I'll head back to the antlion sandbox and um, get more antlion parts, but specifically the pincers, so I can make the uh, antlion great sword. And we're gonna put the freaking um, the spicy glob on it, and we'll have a pretty powerful weapon for ourselves. Um, I'd like to, in the future as well, get something that probably has better heat resistance than what I have. I don't know if anything else has sizzle protection. Maybe the black ox does, but... Or termite, maybe. Dust guard. I haven't even seen any termites. I don't know what overbearing does. We currently, we currently have the antlion poncho on, which is pretty much the same tier as Black Ox. Okay. Spiders were bad enough when they were the size of my pinky toe. Anyway, enough chitter chatter. Like I said, my goal is just to go back to the. What the hell? Oh, that's from that freaking um, wolf spire I killed earlier. I killed like four antlers, um, wolf spires last time. But yeah, that's just like the short term goal, just kind of trying to get that sword made and putting the spicy blob on, and then we'll send the yard once again. Maybe we can try to get that sword again, but last time did not go as well. And also, we need to get more Everchar Cold Chump, because uh, unfortunately. The um the mosquito attack destroyed it. So we can also get the mint mace. We can all, almost get the mint mace right now. Tough gunk is from the is dropped from those larvae, I think. Really poly fire petals are easy as fuck to get. I'm more of a I guess this is kinda this is kinda similar to the club. I'm not really a big fan of the club, so I think I'm gonna stick to the antlion greatsword, so yeah, all of our walls have been damaged, and they somehow broke my freaking... They somehow broke the... The oven through the wall, unfortunately. Or through the window or something, I don't know. They fucking destroyed that shit. The most, like, valuable thing. So now they get more clay, more boiling glands, more Everchar. 
But first, like I said, we're gonna head back to the sandbox. Kill some more antlions. And, um... Craft that sword. Probably kill some black ants while we're there, because we're gonna need to repair our... Sword. Black ant sword, and the... Shield. Because they're both about to break. There's gotta be something that does bear sizzle protection in the in the antlion gear. That was taking so much damage. Unless there's like a, a, a smoothie or something that you can drink to resist your sizzle or not or, or not. I don't really know. I don't really see anything that does. Nice snooter, dude. Whatever. Well, we also fought a new mosquito. There's a tire mosquito that we fought that gave us the uh, allows us to craft the um, tier three mosquito needle, which would be kind of nice to have because I feel like life steal is like one of the best weapon perks. I've had combine that with the freaking with the uh, compliance badge. I mean, it's pretty nice combination right there. Get a lot of health just from freaking blocking and stabbing things. Kill you, Bombardier Beetle. Where were y'all last time I was over here? Things better better than sting bugs. Do that. We need four bullying glands. Actually, no. I think we only need two. We have four just in case. Next time I see a bombardier beetle. Heard larva. I mean, obviously they're crawling on the ground, but a mosquito over there. Hey, fine mosquitoes. Mosquitoes are starting to become one of my least favorite enemies. Just because I like far away they aggro. Firefly, get that goopa down here. There's a scabby right here that I never knew about. Oh, the freaking... The, uh... The fireflies... have some creepy-ass noises. I really need to invest in making a zipline. I know I've said it pretty much every episode, but I'm gonna say it again. I really need to, uh... Find a zip line that goes onto the picnic table. It's kind of annoying not having one. I'm tired of going to the black ant lab. I'm tired of fighting black ants to get into the damn black ant lab or into the sandbox. What was that? Damn. I mean, these are larvae, like I said. You can tell by how loud they are. They're bombing your beetle right there.
You know those freaking bombardier beetles? Not only did the boiling glands use to make the ovens, but we also use their parts for freaking repair glue. Which is what we're gonna need for our armor. I'm gonna die, sorry. I fear they freaking run. Should be so annoying. I'm running. I didn't pick up the last one. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Fucking grass. camp parts so we can prepare the shield i try to avoid every bit of freaking soldier ants i can or they're annoying as fuck it takes so long to kill with the black ant sword even that's level fucking seven or something we're bull Grants aren't too bad at least. Oh, don't run into the haze. Shitty part. Oh my. These, this grass is starting to piss me off. That's what I hate about worker ants, man. They freaking run away from you. And they're low health. You know, fucking chase them. With ants spawning in rocks. Not even just ants, aphids too. That's a red ant. That black ant queen's next. It's fully repaired. Go ahead and apply a bandage. Black ant here, black ant there, black ants get everywhere. Where did this come from? I guess from that. to get the ant lions. I should have stored a lot of this stuff. The sand castle is another place I need to go to while we're here. Completely forgot about it. I'm surprised I ain't a black ant chip over here. I 
that gives me like the uh, poisonous food for the black ant. Yeah, I'm not even, not even gonna fucking bother. Also, I don't remember how to get to the black ant queen. Lord, I know what her favorite food is. I think it's like a cookie sandwich or something. But red ants was the. Yummy gum sandwich. Mushroom sandwich is the favorite of the Red Ant Queen. I might kill some ant lions on the way to the sand castle and then go into the sand castle and see if there's anything there worth grabbing. It's the only place in the sandbox I haven't checked yet. I can't help but think but that the gear that the queen drops, it makes me feel like I should have killed it earlier on. But there's no way, because you can't, you can only make it through with, through the oven, and the only way to get that is by sending in the yard and having something that has sizzle protection on it. So you don't get fucking burned to death. Be actually be able to kill them now. I don't know if they I don't know if they drop anything unique or not. Here. Let me grab it. Jesus, I have to go right on top of it. There's any caves or anything in here. The treasure chest right there. Be a key to it in the sandcastle. Melted moat key. Well, I haven't found that yet. I really hope it's not an underwater section here. I have to go all the way back to get my goddamn freaking uh, bubble helmet. I don't see anything else in the water. We just did a full circle. this there ain't line over here see it too there's two of them I think how do we get in the sand castle that is the question That is the question. I'd say that's how you get the key inside the sand castle.
I say you just jump across from right there. So I'd rather get on top of the edge of the sandbox. And jump across. So that's what I'll go do. We can get on top of the sandbox. Bring it off! So there's a wolf spider. I think I could definitely the little big big ant lines that are in the, the holes. This thing just bit me and did no damage. Okay, that did a little bit of damage, but still not that much. Who's about to win this fight? Ant line versus wolf spider. What the fuck? It seems like the damn top ropes. That was almost a damn stalemate. That was a damn stalemate. I'll try to fight y'all at a later date. I'm really worried, worried about him right now. Very full. Is if I go in that freaking kill the outline on the ground and I can't handle it. Then I'll uh I'll just, it's hard as fuck to escape. Pincers I have none, not four. I need seven, three more. It's like it's gonna be impossible to predict. No point in trying to carry that. There we go, I need two more. Go uh go this way. See an line spawn on the on the edge, it's kinda weird, in my opinion. I'm gonna make some bandages. I cannot pick up that sap earlier. I have sap right here. 
Can we drop? Fuck me. I can be trashed, I guess. Keep hearing shit. So I'll take sizzle damage. Even though I'm not, even though I have the sizzle protection, I wonder. Am I good? I said just jump across here. Definitely should be able to make that jump. I don't know if this is the best spot to jump over though. Fuck it. I had I had to be the right way. Maybe it wasn't. I don't see any way to get over the wall. Right here, maybe. Oh yeah. We're in. If only chemistry class was this easy. by the sizzle just very slowly Fuck. what can we get rid of now Causing this to get pushed like that. Hmm. Assume the key's probably in the inner. Okay, bro. Just have to fight every freaking game line in this freaking sandbox. Sandcastle. Oh, 
treasure chest over here. There we go, we have the sandbox. We have the what we need. Make the great sword. Ooh, salt shard. Oh, what to drop, what to drop, what to drop. I'm kinda tired of make, constantly making a decision. I have no idea what this fucking does, so I'm just gonna make the sacrifice. I'm not seeing an entrance to this yet. Tastes good. See some spicy candy over there, though. Uh, no. What the fuck do I get upper? The key's gotta be over here somewhere. to be I'll be up in that in this but I have no clue how to get up here Confusion. There might be like a zipline or something up there, but I don't even know how to get up to that, to that fucking level. Hmm. What is that? Oh, it's just the background. I thought it was like something shiny on top of the freaking tower. That's how I do, but that that does look juicy. I tried jumping from here to there, but Ooh. no. upper section there because there's freaking quartzite up there. There's gotta be a way onto this too. I have no clue. Ow. I, mean, I tried jumping across. I said maybe aim for that. That's still a fucking hell of a jump. I wasn't sprinting. Can't even over there, maybe it's like around the edge. It's, it's called like the murky moat key. 
usually doesn't give you hints on where it's located. It just tells you where it goes to, kind of like the Minotaur and the Mossy Key. I don't freaking know, man. That might be makeable. If I can jump. Oh, I have mutations. Hold on. I just read. It gives you less fall damage. It, gives me, it makes me faster. Oh, it's gonna be sizzle protection. The French defense does. That's what I need. Okay. Shocking dismissal. Makes me faster. Oh yeah, that made it easy. I mean, but the only thing I see here is the hot candy. There's gotta be a way up there. I think I'm about to give up. I need to... I mean, this place doesn't have... Gotta be hit in the sandbox somewhere, though, surely. I already went all the way around the freaking moat and there wasn't anything in it. Feels like I'm being cooked. I can't take this heat. I guess it's possible it could be inside the on the picnic table, but I don't know. That's probably a stretch. I've been just about any everywhere here. I'm about to, have to take one of these on. Go, let's go.
Okay, everyone. Hey, I see. There's more to this than I thought. I guess each one of these ant lions, these big ant lions, have their own cave, maybe, and one of them will lead me to the key. I see. I wish I knew about this sooner. Very treasure's kind of handy, though. Rub time. Their attacks are doing like no damage. Ow. Holy crap. Sandbox of those freaking buried ant lions. I'm full of freaking shards. Honestly, I have no idea what this does. I consume one and trash the rest. Or I have spicy candy shards because I don't know what they do. Kill one more of those big ant lions and see what they have. So far, they've had all all they've had is pretty good loot. But um, we have the pincers that we need. We're good on that note. That was refreshing. Always left to do in the sandbox. Also, to do in the sandbox is kill all the ant, the big ant lions, and see what, and find the key. Thank <laughs> you. 
You're not very hard to deal with. Except for that attack. That attack kinda fucks me up. This one takes me too. aren't really hard to d deal with. The attacks are very slow and predictable. As long as you just block during their underground attack, then they're not that hard to deal with. Unfortunately, but I'm sure one of these have, have the key. Alright. Well, guys, I guess I'm gonna end the video here. I don't have any much to do. The next time we're gonna kill all the big ant lions, the ones that are leading us to the caves, and we'll uh, hopefully find the key for the sandbox. Or the uh, sand castle, and we'll be able to get some more loot. Hopefully, something decent out of that. So that's just gonna have to wait till next time. Out of time. So hope you guys enjoyed the video as always, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.